The city of Elizabethtown is one of the fastest growing in our state. With the city on the rise, its police department is aiming to match that growth. WDRB's Dalton Godby found out how the E-Town Police Department is expanding. Elizabethtown Police asked for more than $5 million to expand its police station and get more help. The city is delivering because the city is growing. There's a saying around here that all roads lead to Elizabethtown. I-65 runs through E-Town, the Western and Bluegrass Parkways, Patriot Parkway, the Lincoln Parkway, and all of those common denominator is E-Town. And with the biggest economic development in Kentucky's history happening nearby, people and businesses are coming down those roads. We still want to match that growth of our community and make sure we can hit our goals because we don't want to see a reduction in police services. Elizabethtown Police Chief Jeremy Thompson has a problem on his hands. He needs more help to serve this rapidly growing community. He also needs a bigger space to solve that problem. Luckily, he's been given the go ahead to hire 10 more officers and five and a half million dollars to make more room at the police station. We're going to push all of our stuff outside and then we're going to repurpose the areas that are currently housing those items. The building project is expected to start soon, thanks to those millions from the city of Elizabethtown. But next on the agenda is hiring officers. Chief Thompson is trying to expand sworn staff from 77 officers to 87. And 90 officers by the end of 2026 is where we would really like to be. We won't turn down a traditional candidate by any means, but we are looking this particular go around to try and emphasize the lateral. Elizabethtown is expected to double in population in the coming years, and this police department is hoping to grow too, to make sure the people traveling those roads leading to E-Town are safe. With photojournalist Emily Evans, Dalton Godby, WDRB News.